When analyzing a company, I care about three main things. What's the minimum assets it has? Does it have low or no debt? And what's the price for those assets? To gauge assets, I look at the current assets, then minus the total liabilities. If inventory is listed, I will typically subtract about half from the value. Why? Because I treat inventory like it's just boxes sitting in a store. They have no cash value until they're actually sold. I typically will not include fixed assets in my value because I assume these assets will be integral to the business, such as factory or machinery, and thus will never be sold for cash as long as the business is ongoing. If there are long-term investments like stock holdings, I might consider adding 25 to 50% to the value. All I care about is what is the minimum assets I'm likely buying. Then, to know the price of those assets, I simply look at the market cap. If it's lower than my value, I conclude it's a good price. In addition to that, I like to see a company pay regular dividends and have earnings. There's always a chance the numbers could be erroneous or downright fraudulent. So seeing actual cash tells me the numbers are likely correct. But remember, you can always be wrong, so proper risk management still applies.